Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another gameplay of Family Feud for the PS4. So far, I have a five game winnings total of $80,770. In this video right here, game six, I'm hoping I can get this up to $100,770. So let's play the feud. The last time I defeated the Lee family. This time I'll be playing against the Cooper family. The game last time to me wasn't that great. The questions and the answers, they really didn't match up. And now, live this Tuesday, it's time for Family Feud. Game six of Family Feud. I'm Lucky McCoy, your host, back where I belong. Yes, sir. Let's meet the families who are taking on the feud. Now, this is such a good game. Here's the first family who are hoping to take home all the cash. Yes, sir, the Davis family. And today, they'll be taking on the Cooper family. Boo! Our two teams must guess the most popular answers to our survey questions. Whichever team does the best will compete in Fast Money, where they can win our grand prize of $20,000. Fasten yourselves in for some feuding. Let's hit it. Let's play the feud. Let's get things rolling. It's time for the face-off. Let's get someone from each family down in front. The top five answers are got the, on the top board. five answers on the board. Buzz in first to get a shot at answering our survey. If you can find the top answer, you'll choose if your family plays or passes the round. We asked 100 people this question Name one of the approximately 10 words that teenagers use. You're up. Um, dang, I guess. Ah, uh, yes. Survey said, dang. No, not there. Sorry, it's not up there. All right, you're up. Like. We have an answer. And what did our survey say? Like. Dang, that's the number one, and it's only worth 18 points. Play that's cheap pass. right there. I need to play. It's a good start. All right, they're going to play. Your family can sweep up the rest. That's a very cheap number you one answer. For us? Uh, I think this is the first game that they have played. That's what you think, huh? In the first round. Show me the answer. No. There's no there. No. It isn't there. First strike. But you've still got this. I the know. The board said no. Oops. To the answer, no. Time for your so that's guess. pretty good. I need to be thinking of an answer. Dude. Yes. Let's check the board and see if it made it. Dude. It's there. Very nice. Yes. Good. Name one of the approximately ten words uh, that teenagers use. Whatever. All right, <laughs> let's try it. That's a good answer. Is that one of the ones we're still looking for? Whatever. Whatever. Whatever is there. It's number there three. It is. Only two answers remain on the board. Number two and number five. There's only two answers left on the board. Hey. Said with confidence. Did anyone in the survey say this? Hey. No, that's two strikes. Two strikes. Our other family need to get ready to steal. There's two still remaining. Duh. Sure thing. That's a good answer. Is it up there? Let's hope so. 
Duh is there. It's number five. Only one answer remains. Only one answer remain, and it's that number two answer. Name one of the approximately ten words that If it's there, use. they sweep the board. If not, I get a chance to steal. Lit. Good. Okay. If lit is there, they sweep that's the right. board. Lit. Is it there? No, that's three strikes. That's three strikes, and you're out. Only one answer is up there. Yeah. Oh. I'm gonna go with mom. If they can find just one answer, this family will steal the board. I'm gonna go with mom. You could steal these points and give yourselves a great chance. Yeah, that's, a great answer. that's your answer. Let's see if mom Let's is there. See if it's there. Is mom there? Mom. Is it there? No, not there. That's not it. So they win the they win the first round. You nailed down this round. There was only one answer you couldn't find. What was number two? What was the second highest answer? Cool. Cool. I show you is cool a lot. So where are everybody's scores at? And I'm 16 years old. That's just one round down. We've Sometimes when so I'm texting, to have here. I say that's cool. So that was an that was an interesting survey. I'm glad they played though, cause if I would've played, I wouldn't have gotten 47 points. Are you ready for a face I probably would've just been stuck at that 18. Who wants to play? Get over here. All right, so it's time for the second face off. Six answers is what we're Top looking for. Top six answers on the board. Fingers on buzzers, here we go. We took a survey of 100 people, asking them, name the first thing you'd do if a UFO landed in your backyard. You're first, what's your Screen. answer? Screen. It's worth a shot. Our survey said, scream. No, not there. Nada. Let's yeah. move on. Hi. Okie dokie. That's a good answer. Is it on the board? Hi. It's there, number four. Way to go, sport. That's on the board. Are they gonna play again this time? Let's make up your mind time. Pass or play. If they want to keep their winning streak going, they're gonna need you to get strikes. Let's see if you can outsmart them. Okay, so they passed. Run. I bet you've got a great answer for us. In a way, I kind of wish they would have played. Yeah, that's a great answer. Alrighty then. Survey says... Run! That's number two. You found a good answer, but it's not the best answer. Yeah. What's your answer? Panic. Okay. Did our survey agree? Panic. No. Uh-oh, it's not there. And that means you've got yourself a strike. No. I need an answer. I um look, I guess look. Understood. Could it be up there? Let's find out. Look. No. Strike two. Okay, people. Let's be careful here. You can still do it. Look, we've got two strikes. We gotta be careful. Man, the first thing you do with a UFO, land it in your backyard. Walk up to it, I guess. I don't know how to put it in words. So I'm just gonna put walk up to it. 
That's good. Let's see if the board's got it. No. Oh no. So 29 points are available. The team is in with a chance. We just need one answer, and if it's on the board, the round is yours. So far, this game has really been low scoring, but thing you do if sometimes you that's how Family Feud games are. They're low scoring. Sometimes they're high scoring. Take a photo. Yep. I want to see that answer. Is it there? Take photo. That's the number one answer. You've Take a picture. So they have 76 points. Our leading family are adding some big points to their big bundle. Let's see those missing answers. The elusive six. Get gun. Got a gun. I would have never thought of that. Answer. Say hello. Mm, well, I Show technically said walk up answer. to it, so. Call police. How are those scores looking? Don't feel so bad about a big fat zero. Look at it this way. If you end up with nothing, you don't have to pay any taxes on it. The Cooper family are in the lead, 76 to zero. It's time for the double round. This is the round where everything can change. Point values are worth double. It's time for another face-off. Can I have a person from each team join me over here? We're looking for five answers here. Top five answers on the board. All right, let's sweeten the pot a bit. All the point values for this question have been doubled. We got 100 people to answer the following question. Name an animal print that's popular on clothing. Your first. Horse. Here we go then. Let's see if that's a correct answer. Horse. Wow. Not in this survey. You're up. What you got for me? Name an animal print that's popular on clothing. A cow. All right. Time to find out if it's up there. Cow. That's not there. That's not Lion, I guess. For. Think you can do better? Give me what you got. Name an animal print that's popular on clothing. Interesting answer. Did any of our 100 people say it? Lion! No. Oh, it's not there. One look at you tells me you've got the top answer. Name an animal print that's popular on clothing. Giraffe. That's what you're going with? Time to check the board. Giraffe. Unlucky. Dog? I'm going to go to you dog. Got a good answer? Let's hear it. Name an animal print that's popular on clothing. Yeah, that's great. Feeling lucky? Let's see if it's up there. Dog. No, that's not there. Nobody said that one. I'm going to need a guess from you. Name an animal print that's popular on clothing. Snake. Okay, sure. Let's see if that's a good answer. Snake. That's not there. That's not up there. So I'm right. We need to move on. So I'm going to choose this family to play. I guess it's that buzz first. What do you think? Oh. Tiger, I guess. Answer accepted. And our survey says Tiger. Tiger is there. It's on the board, what we could do better. 
A bear, I guess. What do you think? Okay then. Our survey said bear. No. You failed to find an answer, which means you get your first strike of the round. A cat, I guess. So what's your guess going to be? Okay. Oh, okay. Our survey says cat paws. Oh yeah. Cool. Do you have an answer? A bird, I guess. Nice. Our survey says bird. No. Oh, it's another strike. One more strike, and the other family gets to try for a steal. I'm going to monkey. Cause I don't know what can be up there. Monkey, I guess. I see where you're going with this. Show me that answer. Monkey. No, that's three strikes. Dang, folks, that's this has been a low-scoring game. Sorry, folks. Looks like the other family has a chance to steal. All they've got to do is find one answer on the board, and they can steal the round. Name an animal print that's popular on clothing. Jaguar. Are you sure about that? Let's check the board. Jaguar. No, not there. I get the points. They couldn't do it. So I am finally on the board. It's time to take a look at what we didn't find. What was number four? It's time to reveal the fourth answer. Zebra. A zebra. Show me the second most popular answer. Cheetah. What was the top answer? Leopard. Show me those scores. The gap is getting smaller. That's all I'm saying. It's time for a face-off. I'm going to need one person from each family to join me right now. So this is the fourth face-off. Point varies were triple. They have 76, I have 42, so let's see how this is gonna go. We have four to find on this one. Top four answers on the board. The ante again. All questions are now worth triple. We've got answers from 100 people for this question. Name something you wish you could find the off button for. Go for it. Um, someone's mouth, I guess. Got it. Do we have it? Mouth. I've gotten swing and a miss. my answer wrong at the podium. All four times. Got it. All Is four times. There? Show me. Computer. That's incorrect. The number one answer is still a secret. I don't know. These questions have been kind of hard for this uh, video. Ah, uh, yes. What did our survey say? TV. Well, at least TV is there. That's good enough for me. Exactly. Good enough for me, too. It's your time to play or pass. We're going to play. Guess you want to keep that hot streak going, huh? Let's play then. Have you got some feud for thought? Maybe. The off button. 
phone, I guess. We have an answer. Let's take a look. Phone. No. Nope, not up there. So here's hmm. your first strike. Got a guess ready? Because I'm gonna need one. Uh huh. Car, I guess. Oh, I'm not gonna put that. Your fridge, I guess. That's what you think, huh? Is it there? Fridge. No. Other family? I'd be getting ready if I were you. It's up to you. Two strikes. Think you've got it? I think I'm going to put a car. It's worth a shot. You never know what's on that board. Is that answer up there? Car. Ooh, it's not there. Strike, folks. Now this is the worst game of Family Feud. I thought Game Five was the worst, but apparently this game right here is the worst. It only takes one right answer to steal those points. Now, folks, here's the deal. Name something Even if they steal, the no one is gonna have 300 points. So we're gonna go to sudden death. Games constant. Let's try it. Sudden death is when Let's they put one it. answer on the board. That top answer. Games console. It's not there. That's not the one. So we're going to sudden death regardless. The score is 63 to 76. We've got a win over here. Let's see what you missed. What was number three? Let's see what's behind number three. Vacuum cleaner. Mm. I want to see number two. Kids. Wow. Come on, let's take a look at that missing top answer. Spouse. It's time to check out the current scores. It ain't over yet. We need one more round to settle things. So whoever wins sudden death, whether they get 300 points or not, wins the game. Neither team has surpassed 300 points. So that means we need a decider. Let's play Sudden Death. This is our first time playing Sudden right. Death Give in this family feud for the PS4 series. They're asking for the top answer only. Whoever gets it right wins the game. This time, I just want you to get point me the varies top remain answer. triple. For this survey, we're asking for the top answer only. Points are tripled. Whoever gets this answer wins the round. We conducted a survey of 100 people for this question. Give me a word that rhymes with moose. You buzzed in first. Um, goose. Said with confidence. Could it be there? Yes, goose, it, goose is there. I win. We're in the points. You've won sudden death. You know what happens next. You get to play fast money. Even though I didn't get the 300 points to win, whoever wins sudden win death today. wins the game. So we will set game seven. Buckle up for some big bucks. It's time to play. That was fast a close one. Money. And now we need to know who's playing. Okay, Captain. That was a good Which question to ask for sudden death, though. Do you want to play fast money with? Very What's good question. Okay, let's do this. You're going to go first. I'm going to ask you five survey questions, which you'll answer against the clock. If you and your teammate can score more than 200 points, you'll win the jackpot. Let's start the clock. Name something you only have one set of. Hands. Name something that might fall out of a person's ear. Wax, I guess. 
Name an object or organism that's small and green. Hmm. Pass. What might you forget to put on before leaving the house? Um, deodorant. Name something on your desk you shouldn't use to clean your ears. Pencil. Name an object or organism that's small and green. Hmm. Small and green. I don't know what they consider grass. I mean, like, grass is alive. And it is small, small and green, so. That's everything. Grass. Now let's see how well your partner does with fast money. Now it's your turn. You'll be answering the same questions. You can't repeat anything that's already been said, because if you do, you'll have to make another guess. Your time starts now. Name something you only have one set of. One set of feet. Name something that might fall out of a person's ear. Pass. Name an object or organism that's small and green. A pepper. I just thought of it. What might you forget to put on before leaving the house? Um, jacket, I guess. Your jacket. Some people forget to put their jackets on. Name something on your desk you shouldn't use to clean your ears. A pen? Something different? Okay, um... I don't know. I don't know. Name something that might fall out of a person's ear. Pencil, I guess. I know people don't stick pencils in their ear. I know they have it. Like on the back of their ear or whatever, but... Still, that's something I can think of right now. That's all five. Let's see, do I have the two hundred points? If I had the two hundred points, I have a six-game winnings total of one hundred thousand seven hundred and seventy dollars. So let's see what I got. For our first question, we asked, "Name something you only have one set of." You said. Two impressive answers here. One of those uh -huh. is clearly better than the other. Eyes. Oh, that's that true. That was worth the most points. Our second question was. So I need 195 to win. That might fall out of a it's still team. very doable. Your answers. Did either of these get any big points? A hey. top answer. Mm, I got 45 and 155 away. Name an I think. Or organism that's small and green. I'm just having a point anymore. Oh, I'm actually the 154 away. Don't they? Two more questions to go. Yikes. These really need to count, or you're out. P. A P. Oh, true enough. The best answer. Next up, we asked. What might you forget to put on before leaving the house? This is how you answered. That's two strong answers right there. Oh, you have got to, to be kidding me. Shoes. Okay, so folks, I want. That was our top What answer. person forgets to put on shoes and before the they leave the house? Shoot, it wouldn't surprise me if clothes was up there. To clean your ears. This is what you said. And for the last time. Ouch. So I got 125. So sorry. No, Unfortunately, no, no. you didn't do well enough to win that jackpot. Looks like you won't get the $20,000, but you'll still get to go away with something. We're going to take your score from the whole game and turn it into some money. Next time, folks, on the view. Good night. So, ladies and gentlemen, 
I had 125 points. So I get five dollars points. So 125 times five is 625. So I have a total of 60,000 plus 770 plus that will equal to um, $61,395. So folks, I have a six game winnings total of $61,395. So ladies and gentlemen, hope you all enjoyed this gameplay of Family Field for the PS4. Game seven is to come in the near future. This is Legend Davis number one. Saying thanks for watching. I'll see y'all for game seven of the Family Feud.